I'm an outlaw because this is home. We come together as one, one nation, one team. I'm an American outlaw. I'm an American outlaw. Because we all support both the men's and women's team and travel to do so. Military family, so grew up overseas. Soccer was definitely a huge part of growing up. Came to the States, me and a buddy decided to go see a US game. First game for both of us. Over on the other side of the field, you're hearing all these rowdy people. And I was like, all right, well then who is that? Because that's what we want to do. We go, they go. The outlaws are everywhere. The growth of American Outlaws is right in line with the growth of U.S. soccer. We're going to be behind you every single kick of the ball, every single throw-in corner kick. We're going to make ourselves known. People will know that now, coming to America, you're walking to a fortress. I'm an American Outlaw because of AO family, and I want to unite and strengthen and travel and support the U.S. national team. I've been a fan of soccer my whole life. I played. This is just another way to be around people that love the sport that I love. It's a beautiful concept that you don't get in any other sport in the United States. It's really an amalgamation of America. Columbus, D.C., Seattle, KC. Doesn't matter where you go, this support is here. I'm an American outlaw because I want to do my part to make the American soccer culture grow to the next level. I'm an American outlaw because I believe the red, white, and blue just like they do. Getting ready to go on 10 years of the American Outlaws. It's crazy back when we only had one chapter and now we have over 187 chapters and over 32,000 members. That's where our motto started, unite and strengthen. So if we can unite all these fans from different backgrounds, different places in this country, it'll just strengthen the section and grow and keep growing. You have to have a local community in your own city and bring all these fans together and watch all the games. But then at the same time, bring everyone together nationally. The night before is there to get hyped up for those 90 minutes. organization. We love working with the local groups when we come to those cities. Whenever we do get rewarded a game, it's a huge honor. We all just flip out. It's the biggest honor you could be bestowed, especially as a local chapter. We start planning out our TIFO, our tailgate. We're bringing our members in from all over the country. American Outlaws, Minneapolis, St. Paul, chapter number 47. I'm an outlaw because AO family is a real and beautiful thing. The amount of open, welcoming support from people all around the nation is just amazingly heartwarming. It's not just soccer, it's a culture. We really are that 12th man on the field for home games. If you're going to international games, it's a, it's a different story. I'm an outlaw because I love getting my passport stamped. I've been all around the world following the U.S. soccer team. And I'll tell you what, I enjoy the away games more than the home games because I love to mix it up with the opposing fans. I've had a lot of good experiences in so many countries around the world. If it wasn't for the American Outlaws, you would not see the great American support you do. We got this, we got this. I told you, I told you. I can barely hear myself think. We hadn't even qualified for the World Cup yet, and we sold out our complete package. We sold out the first plane in one day. We sold out three planes in a week. Being at a World Cup is like nothing in the entire world. We really took it upon ourselves to grow what support is for the women's team as well. The world champion U.S. women's soccer team. The third World Cup for this nation. The march into the stadium is absolutely amazing. It's telling the world, man, we're coming. And we're there for the team. 
U.S. fans that all share the same passion as you, that are walking into the stadium and you really just feel the energy. People talk about it and they say it, but I think that you can really feel like these are your brothers and your sisters when you're walking into the game. goal happens in a game, that is the best experience that you've ever had. There is nothing better than that feeling when they score the goal. It's the best feeling ever. Our energy, our vibe, everything that we do comes together as one. Enjoying the moment, enjoying it for the team, and enjoying it with your closest friends. Megan Rapinoe's pass to Abby Wambach in the 2011 World Cup, that headed goal against Brazil that got him into overtime and eventually the win, nothing can ever top that. One of the coolest experiences when Landon Donovan retired and he came over to the section, I was standing next to him and he wanted to lead a chant and I was just like so nervous because I was like I didn't want to mess up the chant and, I, and it's like we all know the chants. After we were done the chant, he gave a hug and then he said thank you for everything you guys do. One of the best experiences of my life was watching USA Ghana in the Men's World Cup. I barely made it to Natal. We're in the bar with everyone from AO. And when Dempsey scores. And there's beer flying and people jumping up and down and hugging and kissing. I got teary-eyed. I'm an adult and I cried for that goal. Carly Lloyd is chipping the goalkeeper and it's just getting chaotic at that point. It's awesome. The most important thing is that we are there for the players and the players acknowledging that when the game's over to see that the American Outlaws are going to be there for every single game, home or away. American Outlaws has already supported us really well. Match day, it's good to see their faces, good to see the colors and, and hear them singing. American fans. It's, it's an honor. It's been a dream of mine my whole life. The American Outlaws made it a special night. The first second we walked on the field, we knew it was going to be an American crowd that was going to push us on. We're Outlaws because I want to support the next generation of U.S. soccer fans. I'm an American Outlaw because I want to be with a group that made noise, and that's what the Outlaws do. I'm an Outlaw because I love the game. I'm an Outlaw because I love her. I'm an American outlaw because I love the camaraderie, men's team, women's team, and just soccer in general, but supporting our country. I'm an American outlaw because I love soccer, I love the U.S., and this group is about supporting all the teams and growing support for the sport as a community, and that's what we need. We need that groundswell of support for American soccer. I'm an American outlaw because there's nothing like being in a section for a U.S. match. Everybody united in one voice. 